Hey guys, welcome to this full body routine. I'm out on my patio in the beautiful sunshine to take advantage of this lovely lighting. So grab your mat, a water bottle, um, a pair of dumbbells, anywhere from three to eight pounds will probably do you right. And crank up your favorite music and let's get going. First, we're gonna start with a warm up. Let's squat and reach. So as we're squatting, I want your butt to stick your butt back, not have your knees forward. So the butt hinges back, so the knees can stay in line with your toes and your ankles. Let's do 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, whew, 11, 10, these last 10, let's do a punch, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay, let's run in place a little bit. We're just warming up the body, getting it ready to uh, lift weights. Uh, more muscles mean more comfortable weightlifting and less prone to injury. So let's just pick it up. 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Done. Do some jump squats. Okay, this will get your heart rate up. So make sure your weight's out of the way so you don't jump on it. And you're going to go somewhat wide. And again, remember you're going to sit the butt back, not have the knees come forward. Okay, that's so important for your knee health. I'm going to have you squat down, maybe touch down, keep your chest up, and then you're going to pop up, okay? So, ready? Here we go. Squat. Jump it up. Two, try to touch the ground. Three, if you can't, that's okay. Four, keep the weight in the heels. Five, sit the booty back. Six, seven, eight, I'm going to do 15. Nine, quit when you need to, though. Ten, eleven, woo, twelve. 13, 14, press it up, 15, whoo, okay, the back, the back can seem like a challenging thing to work without weights, but I got it covered, so I'm going to have you lay down on your bellies, and catch my breath first, and I'm sure you need to too, nice deep breaths, so watch me first, and then we'll do it together. So make sure your shoulder blades stay down your back. I'm just gonna reach my hands out. And I'm gonna pull back and lift up with my chest. I'm using the strength of my lower back. So I reach out and pull back. Okay, are you in position? You're gonna feel this in your glutes, your lower back, your upper back as you squeeze back. It's a great exercise, okay? So laying on the bellies, make sure your neck stays long, reach out. Ready? Inhale up. One, two, three, four, five. You might not be able to do 15 of these. Six are really hard. Seven, eight, quit when you need to. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, whew, 14, last one, 15. Oh, I feel bad. So I'm gonna sink into a child's pose to stretch it out and breathe. Okay, next thing we're doing is deadlifts one, with one leg and one dumbbell. So it's gonna work the shoulders too, but mainly we're gonna work the hamstrings. It's a straight leg deadlift. Take one of your weights. So don't do it yet until I, I show you. So. So you're gonna have the same arm, same leg. The leg goes up as the arm goes down. And then you pull it all the way up. So let me show you from the side. I'm gonna stay, stay nice and tall. Chest up, shoulders back and down. So I'm gonna start with my left hand, left leg. And I just hinge at the hips and as I hinge forward, my leg goes up. See how straight my spine is? And then I just pull it up. And then I'm gonna press it up. And you can cheat if you need to touch down on the ground with your toe. You can do that. And then I'm going to do it again. Pull it up. Press it up. 
okay? So grab your weight, ground in with your right foot, nice and tall. Think about your chest going forward as you hinge at your hips. Let the weight hang dead, so don't reach it out. Okay, so are you guys ready? Have your weight, and it's gonna be a light weight, so not too heavy here. Here we go. Stretch it out, bring it up, and press it up. That's one. I'm gonna do 10 of these, because they're really hard. Two. Whoop, three. Challenging the balance. Four. <laughs> Five, I look sloppy. Six. Ooh. Seven. Eight. Abs stay tight. Nine. Last one on this leg. Oh. Ten. Okay, we're gonna do the other side. So I'm gonna turn around so you can just see it better. Ooh, that's burning. Right hand, right leg is gonna go up. Chest up, abs tight. Hinge at your hips, lead with your chest. Here we go. Pull it up with the hamstring, then press it up with the shoulder. One. Two, make a focus point ahead of you. That's kind of helpful. Three. Oh, I'm much more balanced on this side. Four. Good job. Oh, five. Hinge at your hips, lead with your chest, straight legs. Six, ooh, touch down. Seven, Are you with me? Eight, you should be feeling this really good in the hamstrings. Oh, pull it up. Nine, I'm touching down now with my toe, that's okay though. 10, okay. Yeah, you should feel that right here in the right hammy when you're doing the right leg. Okay, so left hammy, I should say, when you're lifting the right leg. Down we go. Onto the bellies. Shoulder blades are back and down. Crown the heads are reaching kind of forward. You don't want to jam into your neck. So keep it long. Reach out. Here we go. One, two, lift the chest up. Three, four. Use the strength of your lower back. Five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I'm gonna do fifteen of these. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Whoa. Okay. Child's pose. Stretch it out. Breathe. And let's come up again. So this time, let's start with the other leg first. So right hand, right leg. Right leg goes up as the right arm comes down. Nice and tall, roll your shoulder blades back and down. Engage your core. Make sure my microphone's still there. It is. Nice and tall. Hinge at your hips, lead with your chest. And then press it up. One, come down, whoa. Two, pick a focus point. Three, abs tight. Four, spine stays straight, legs stay straight. Four, five, I'm looking at that, at that leaf on the ground. Six, come all the way up nice and tall. Seven, eight, nine, and 10. Woo, baby, right here. Okay, so here we go. Other side, you ready? Left hand, left leg goes up. One, two, three, keep your abs tight, 
Four, oh, there goes the construction next door. Five. Six, hopefully they won't be too noisy. Ah, seven. Oh, whoops, eight. Two more. Nine. And 10. Oh, I'm glad we're done with those. They take forever, but they're so good for you. They're working not only your hamstring, but your lower back and your core and your balance. So do them. It's worth it. Okay, so next we're going to do some reverse flies. So you're going to want a lightweight for this, a five pound, maybe three pound. You could try it with the eight pounds, but you might not get a lot done. That's okay. So you're going to roll your shoulder blades back and down. Let me demonstrate it to you first before you do it. Hinging at the hips, leading with your chest, coming into a fold, and we're just going to fly out. Let me show you from the front. Fly out. So don't round your back here. Keep your chest up, shoulder blades back and down. And we'll turn to this angle. So have your weights ready. We're going to hinge at the hips, lead with the chest, coming in this fold this bend with the knees bent. Nice straight spine, abs tight, let's fly. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, whoo, 10, keep your shoulders down your back. 11, keep long through your neck. 12, 13, 14, last one for me. 15, come all the way up. Okay, get your weights out of the way. So we're gonna do some lunges. You got a couple options here. You can do jumping lunges, which is what I'm gonna do. And I'll show them to you. I'm just gonna go wide, come down. The weight's through my front heel. I'm gonna stay tall and then pop it up and switch sides. So I don't wanna bring the weight to the back. I wanna keep it forward like this. Okay, so I'm always pressing through that front heel. I should always be able to wiggle those toes. So if that's not right for you, if it hurts your knees or whatever, because it's a lot of cardio too, you can switch like this, okay? So I'm gonna do 20 jumps. It's gonna kill me, but I'm gonna do 20 of them. You can do the modified if you need to. Um, it might feel like it's, I'm counting too fast for you. If you're doing the modified, that's okay. Get what you can done. Pop it down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, abs tight, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, whew, it's burning, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 and 20. That's hard. Walk it out. Deep breaths in. Let's take a water break. So hopefully you brought your water. And keep walking it out. Okay. We're gonna do flies again. Sorry if I'm breathing heavy into the speaker. Those are hard. I think I'm gonna do modified next. Okay, grab your weights. Chest up, shoulders back and down. Hinge forward. Back is straight, knees are bent. Shoulders are back and down, neck is long. Fly it. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Uh, come on up. Whew. Set your weights down. Get set up for your lunges. You can do jumping if you want. Or you can do the modified. I'm going to show you the modified. We're going to drop down, step forward, 
step forward. See that? Okay, ready? So step back, drop down, come forward. Two, again, three, weights in the heels. Four, stay tall. Five, six, if you're jumping, try to do 20 of them. This is eight, nine, weights through the heel. 10, halfway there. 11, step back, drop down, pull forward and up. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Yay, okay. We're gonna come down to the floor. Oh, that feels good. Fingers pointing towards your toes. Roll your shoulder blades back and down. Lift your chest up and then lift your hips way up high so you have space to come down. So let me show you before you begin. I'm gonna kick the elbows back and see how my hips are up. I have space to come down when I do that. If my hips were up, I'd have no room to come down. So lift those hips up high. Ready? Shoulder blades back and down. Kick the elbows back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Five more. Eleven. Push it. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Ooh, you should feel that burning in the back of your arms. Come on down. Okay, so knees are bent, toes are pointed, or fingers are pointed towards your toes. Roll your shoulder blades back and down, lift your chest up high. Lift the hips up high as the go for you. Keep the shoulder blades back and down and your neck long. Keep looking up as you kick the elbows back. One, two, three, press it up. Four, five, dip it down to six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Woo! We are done. Give yourself a hand for getting through this.